So today is actually Memorial Day and it is sunny and warm. I put Porter in the pool just to like contain him and I put a bunch of like water toys in there. He seems happy. Hi! If I put him on the grass, he, he actually doesn't mind the grass, but he tries and eats it and then it's just not good. So I'm keeping him contained and Grayson is just playing with some toys. Anthony did an awesome job mowing. Oh, you're gonna mow? Grayson's gonna do some more mowing. I hope you all are having a great Memorial Day weekend. Um, this is obviously the end of the weekend. Anthony goes back to work tomorrow and we are going to Toledo for some events. So um, a busy week ahead of us, but on today's agenda, Anthony is going to patch those holes finally um, that those birds did. I'll show you guys again if you hadn't seen my previous vlog. This is the back of our house and a couple birds came and made huge holes on the bottom of it and built a nest. And there was a bunch of baby birds like right in there. And I don't know why, but they ended up like pushing all of the nest out. Like this is the remnants of it. I don't know why they did that. We have not heard any movement or any baby birds for about a week now. So we're pretty sure like the birds are gone now. So um, that's why we're gonna patch the hole today because we don't want any more birds making more nests in there. I guess I was reading that like birds will just keep coming back to the same nest year after year. So we don't want that. And we don't want bats or squirrels or anything else to get up in that hole. So that's on Anthony's agenda today is to patch the holes while I entertain the babies. Did you find a stick? It looks like uh, E. Or a Y, sure. <laughs> Hi, Bubba. So here's the update. Anthony totally patched the hole. If you remember, there were two really big holes on this side and a really big side on the other. And you can hardly even tell there was anything. Anthony worked really, really hard and patched it up and painted it. And now it looks great. And there's no more animals in our holes. Here's the other side, totally patched up and looking great. Anthony is awesome and does a lot of house projects for me and I help clean up. That's about all I did for that, but it looks really good and I'm so glad we won't have any more birds screaming in our walls anymore um, until they find another place to invade and then we have to do it all over again. But hopefully that doesn't happen anytime soon. Is that a grill? That's that's our AC unit to keep our house cool. Say good job, Daddy. Good job, Daddy. Thank you. Oh, Grace, say hi. Hi. We got Grayson, and we got hi, Felix. Hi, Felix. And we've got Porter. Porter bounce! Yay! So I am packing all of us up. We are traveling to Toledo today. It's gonna be a quick one day trip. We are gonna go, uh, my brother Patrick just graduated from high school and so we are having a cousin graduation party because not only did he graduate from high school, but two of my other cousins also graduated from high school. We have a big family, so this kind of thing happens. So we're just having one huge family grab party. And so I'm going to go and take the boys. Unfortunately, it's on a Tuesday, so Anthony can't come. Uh, he has to work, so he is missing out. Uh, but we are going to make the trip. Say a prayer for me. Hopefully the boys are good. Grayson is usually good in the car. Porter, however, is not. We're intentionally going at Porter's nap time, so hopefully he just sleeps the whole time in the car. I don't know, I'm still like recovering from last time we went. We went on Christmas Eve and Porter and Grayson both cried the whole time. It was terrible. But I got Porter in the cutest little outfit. Yeah. Grayson, get down. Do not stand on the table. Gray, get down. Get down. Oh my goodness. 
There's always something going on. It's a beautiful day today, so a great day to have a grad party. So I'm sure I'll take clips here and there of like decorations and stuff. Um, I think it's gonna be a lot of people at this party, so it should be really, really fun. My cousins, I just don't see them that often because we're not in Toledo anymore, so it'll be fun to catch up with everyone. But we'll see how it goes. Say bye. bye. Say bye, Porter. Bye, Are you jumping on the trampoline? Grace says, I don't want to be at the party. I want to jump on the trampoline where no one is. Woo! Good job. Hey guys, so um, we are actually back in Columbus. It's the next day. Um, I didn't vlog very much. It was just a lot of time meeting with family, but we did end up going to my cousin's cottage. That's what you saw the lake um, video of. Um, my cousins have a cottage up at Devil's Lake up in Michigan, and we hadn't seen it yet, so we went to go and see it, and um, it was a lot of fun, although the weather was terrible. It was cold and rainy the whole day. But it was still fun. We went out on the pontoon for like 10 minutes and then it was too cold. And um, the boys had a great time. And yeah, we just had fun visiting family, but we are you back in Columbus. Open? We had a long drive, didn't get home until like 9.30 at night. Um, and so both boys are kind of off their sleep schedules, but we are slowly getting back on track. But. Um, anyway, I just wanted to close out the vlog. Like I said, I didn't um, vlog as much as I wanted to, but like it's kind of awkward vlogging. I like extend a family who I haven't even seen that much. So I just took little snippets here and there, but we are back and um, I hope you guys enjoyed the vlog and I will see you guys next time. Bye. Say bye, <laughs> That smile. He is the cutest baby. Gray, say bye. Bye. Say bye, Ford. Bye, Ford. <laughs>